Hello and thank you for joining us in another of these vodcasts on the 2014 Innovation Fund. My name is Paul Martin from the Partners in Recovery team at Metro North Brisbane Medicare Local and I'm here with Jacqueline Hendricks and Lucky Zenu from the Pharmacy Guild Australia Queensland branch. Welcome along. Thank you Paul. Thanks Paul. Great. It's good to have you here. Uh, Lucky, if you could start off by just telling us a little bit about what the Pharmacy Guild does. Yeah, sure, no worries. The, the Pharmacy Guild was established in 1928 and the Pharmacy Guild is actually the national peak body representing community pharmacy. It's a membership organisation and its members are the proprietors of community pharmacy. So in essence it seeks to serve the interests of its members and support community pharmacy deliver quality health outcomes to all Australians. A major role of the Guild is to liaise and negotiate with governments, wholesalers, manufacturers, and other organisations in healthcare delivery systems. Another other roles that the Guild may do or do do is assist with quality assurance, training for, for both pharmacy staff, pharmacy interns and delivery of continuing professional development and, uh, and other services as well. Great, thanks Lucky. Yeah, no worries. Uh, so Jacqueline, uh, your project, uh, the Innovation Fund project, is looking at the interface between community pharmacy, people living with a mental illness and those mental health services that are there to support them. So uh, firstly, what's the project hoping to achieve? Yep. Thank you, Paul. Um, the major focus of the project is to maximise the potential of community pharmacy um, and pharmacy's assistance in, in supporting people with complex mental illness. The project's main objective is to integrate the services of PII agencies, mental health support services and community pharmacy um, to create a holistic patient-centred care. Great. Mm -hmm. And so what types of activities or, or tasks will be undertaken in the project to achieve those outcomes? So it's actually a bit of a two-prong approach when it comes to the project. Firstly, we'll be involving and um, educating the mental health services, partners and recovery agencies about what it is that community pharmacy actually does. Um, and how community pharmacy can help a patient um, with their treatment goals, with the medication management, and also including a community pharmacy as, pa as part of the patient's care team. Secondly, we're educating community pharmacy about what it is that Partners in Recovery does and what do um, the mental health, mental health support services do in the Metro North area and their capabilities and their services that are available. Overall, the project hopes to build really robust and sustainable relationships between community pharmacy and the mental health support services. Excellent. So lots of really great connections there yeah. at a community level. Yep. Uh, so the partners in Partners in Recovery means that all of the work that we do involves a wide range of stakeholders, partners, collaborators. So who's involved in delivering this project? Yep. So we've had tremendous support from a lot of the mental health support services and the Partners in Recovery agencies. Um, our first um, event to community pharmacies involved um, members from Metro North Hospital and Health Services, Communify and also from the Queensland Alliance speaking to community pharmacies about the involvement they have with community health and their service and, and roles. Moving forward we have a medication workshop which will involve a psychiatrist from the Metro North Hospital and Health Service so we've really got a lot of people involved and, and supportive of the project. That's great. Uh, so if people watching this podcast are interested in finding out some more information about the project, how can they get in contact? Yeah. You can contact the Pharmacy Guild of Australia Queensland branch and request to speak to myself or Lucky. Their phone number is 3831 3788 or alternatively you can jump on the website um, and visit us on guild.au forward slash QLD underscore branch and have a search for the Partners in Recovery project. It's got some great resources for consumers and carers, but also for some mental health support services and also any pharmacies wanting to get involved. Lovely. Well, thank you, Jacqueline. Thank you, Lucky, for sharing with us, uh, viewers, the details of your 2014 Innovation Fund project. Um, if you would like to see more of the Innovation Fund projects, please go to the Partners in Recovery North Brisbane website um, or search for us uh, on YouTube. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.